MLB The Show's coverage of minor league baseball is on the air as we continue our tour around the minor league. Ought to be a good one here between the Pensacola Blue Wahoos and the Birmingham Barons. And before we get too much further, here's a look at each manager's starting lineup here for the opener. And let's also get a brief look at our two starting pitchers as you see how they stack up right there. Frankie Dawson will make his way in now. He drove in two of his club's three runs in last night's game. Dawson. First offering on the way. A fastball here as he'll take a look at ball one. One and oh. Here's the one oh. Two and oh. Here's the 2-0. Swing and a ball hit foul as this will find the seats in right. Here's the 2-1 pitch. A little too tall that time. 3-1 and one now. The 3-1. There's the good fastball, and he can't catch up. 3-2. and two. And sometimes you got to cut down a little stride against a guy who's throwing this hard. Either you take that leg kick completely out of the equation, or you get it started just a little bit quicker. And he lost him here on 3-2 as that pitch misses. It's ball four. Yeah, that's nice to see a little patience up there. These guys have been what I would call overly aggressive these first few innings. Finally, somebody's figured out the importance of maybe taking a pitch or two. Alex Rodriguez will stand in back in the lineup after getting the night off yesterday. Now the first pitch. In there, 0-1. Oh Seemed to quicken his delivery to the plate on that last pitch. Well, you got to remember the slide step does two things for you. It gets the catcher the ball quicker so he can throw a guy out, or it will hold the runner on first so he doesn't steal at all. He set now the pitch. Pitch swung on and missed the throw. It's offline, but he's out. Gunned down trying to swipe the base. If you're not an absolute speed merchant on the bases, if the pitcher slide steps, he's got a much better chance of throwing you out. The defense sniffed it out right there. The slide step worked. Great throw to second base, and he's gone. Frankie Dawson will dig in. Drew a walk his first time around. Now here's the first pitch. And now this is swung on and pulled down the third base line. The second for one. Relay to first in time. And just like that, this side is retired. A golden opportunity to get on the board. Here goes for naught. We're back with more on this Monday night after this. Frankie Dawson will get another shot. He hit into a double play his last time. Here's the first offering. Dawson. And here's a ball hit in the air. But this is going to wind up a foul ball. Now here's the pitch. And he's finding new life out there in the sixth inning as this is swung on and missed. It's 0-2 now. And you kind of get the sense that he's not really messing around out there too much. There hasn't been a whole lot of setting guys up here in this inning. He's just trying to get himself back into that dugout as fast as he can. Tried to throw the fastball by him, but it's high. 1-2. and two. The 1-2. Now a fastball runs inside and drills him. Oh, that's got to hurt. Ah, 
and this might be just what the crowd needs to get off their hands a little bit. Last thing you want to do on the mound is hit a guy and have the crowd come to life again. Action in the bullpen now as a right-hander begins to throw out there. First things first, here's the throw over. Oh, and he breaks, and they've got him picked off. And a tag, and he is out easily. So they breeze through this half of the inning. Seventh inning coming up. Pensacola's out in front here, 4-2. to two. Frankie Dawson will get another shot, hit by a pitch his last time. Frankie Dawson. First pitch coming. Runner goes for second. Pitch swung on and missed the throw. In time as he just gets the tag down. Here's the pitch. Oh, I had him reaching a thin air that time, and he's very quickly down 0-2. Oh, man, what a perfect pitch right there in a perfect spot. And that's exactly how you have to attack a guy like this. He wasn't even close on that pitch. We're in the eighth inning now of a 4-4 ball game. And here's the ball lifted back toward the stands in right, so we'll try it again at 1-2. Again, a 1-2. And this is on the ground toward the hole. And a great diving effort there, but it'll just tip off his glove, and it's a base hit. Now batter, third baseman, Alex Rodriguez. Alex Rodriguez will stand in. He homered back in the fifth inning of this one. Now action in the bullpen as their closer starts to get loose out there. First pitch coming. Oh, he lifts a high pop-up. Drifting into foul territory on the right side. And eight innings have come and gone now as the inning is over. So it's no runs on a hit, no errors, and a man left. We've played eight full, and we are tied 4-4. Frankie Dawson will stand in. He's one for two so far. Here's the first pitch. Now a swing and a fly ball. And it's a foul ball. The 0-1. Fouled straight back. Now the 0-2 pitch. And he couldn't get him to chase the 0-2 fastball. It's 1-2. and two. Well, I, I think that fastball is just for show there. He's not trying to throw this for a strike. Two, two. To two balls and two strikes now. Possible winning run stands at first with two out here. Here's the 2-2 two, two pitch. And he misses this one inside, and that'll run things full 3-2. and two. And now the benefit of you working the count to 3-2 is that that runner gets a head start from first with two away. And he gets under this one and, in fact, breaks his bat as this one's popped up. Rincon is there to make the catch, and that means we've got more baseball ahead. So a good job of collectively swinging the bats in this one, but if we had to single out one guy who outshined all others, I think it's the man who stands out right here. He's our top player of the game. Stars of tomorrow get their shot in the limelight today as the show's coverage of the Southern League is on the air. Tonight, an intriguing matchup between the Pensacola Blue Wahoos and the Birmingham Barons. Frankie Dawson digs in at the plate. Now the first pitch. 
And this is going to be a foul ball. Runners on first with one down. He's set, now the pitch. And this ball's heading for the seats down the right side as the count will move to 0-2 now. He's ready now, the pitch. And here's a fastball on 0-2, but it misses 1-2 and two now. Eric, you take a look at our visiting club as they take the field tonight here in the bottom of the first. They come into this one in good spirits, fresh off their first victory of the new campaign last time out. Yeah, when you look back to that last game, you'll take production like that anytime you can get it. It makes a starter's life easier. Heck, it makes your whole staff breathe easier. Here comes a 2-2. Swing and a miss on the changeup, and there are two gone. Dawson will lead things off here in the home half of the fourth. First offering on the way. Dawson. And a check swing looked like he went around. Yes, indeed, says the first base umpire. Strike one. Pitch on the way. And a fastball way off target here, and it's even at one. Here's the 1-1. One, one. Now here's a ground ball that will get by the mound and into center field for a leadoff single. Andy Wilkins will dig in here. Flew out his first time around. First pitch coming. And that's lifted in the air out toward left. Aquino will settle under it to make the play for the first out as the runner will have to head back to first. Mike Compton will try it again. He flew out his first time. Here's the first offering. In there, 0-1. Well, as we've seen so far, this isn't a team that's going to wait around too long to feel a pitcher out. They're an aggressive team all the way from top to bottom. And if that first pitch is anywhere close, most of these guys are going to take a hack at it. Tries to shave the corner with that pitch, but it's one and one. Now the one and one pitch. And now a pitch hit sharply on the ground. And he tries for the backhand reach at third, but it gets by the glove down the line. The relay, and he will make it back in there. He's safe at second base. Johnny Overton will dig in here. Took a called third strike his first time. Good lead off the second there. Now the pitch. In there at the letters 0 and 1. And you know, whenever he's been in trouble on the mound, he's found a way to turn things around. And that's a good job to start this guy with strike one. Swinging a ball hit on the ground, but this will wind up a foul ball, strike two. He's ready. Now the pitch. And here's a ball hit in the air. And he'll put this one away in foul territory for the second out. Derek Lamb will get a shot here with two on and two out here in the fourth. Now here's the first pitch. Drops in a strike to start the at-bat. Nothing and one. Tonight, borderline calls. You got to be swinging. Two men are on with two men out. From the belt, kicks and deals. Now a hard hit ball back up the middle. And that'll get through into center field for a base hit. Around third and being waved on home. And they are on the board as the run scores from second to narrow the gap to 3-1 now. That's all about picking up your teammate there. The guy before him hops up and can't get the run home, so he's up there saying, hey, don't worry, I got it. He knocks in the two-out RBI. Frankie Dawson will stand in. A strikeout victim his first time and then a base hit last time around. Who started him with the change and it's nothing in one. Yeah, and it seems like he kind of got away from that pitch here in the last few innings. You got to think about bringing that one right back. He's set. Now the pitch. There's a chopper foul over to the right side. 0-2 now. Pause, now the pitch. 
Not a bad pitch there with two strikes, but it misses one and two. Mm, tough pitch to lay off there with two strikes. I'm not sure if that was a good take or whether he just got fooled on a changeup and couldn't pull the trigger. That misses, and we're even at two and two. Yeah, that was outside, but it's right where he wants that pitch to be. If you do take that thing, there's no guarantee that it won't be called strike three. And this is in the air to straightaway right. We'll see if it's enough to get that runner to third. And that's taken in straightaway right. Will he try from second? The relay throw, and he is in there. Dawson will step in now to lead off the home half of the seventh. Designated hitter. Frankie First pitch coming. Dawson. A fastball off the plate away. It's ball one. Now here's the pitch. Swing and a ball hit softly on the ground. But a foul ball, one and one. Ready now on one and one. Outside, two and one. Here's the two and one pitch. Swing and a hot shot towards the hole. And that will get through into right. So there's your possible go-ahead run on base to lead off the inning. A good sign here to start the home seven. Now he finds a pitch to his liking there, and now the go-ahead runs on base to kick off the inning. Andy Wilkins will stand in, one of the few guys not to join the hit parade so far. Some action out in the bullpen, a couple of right-handers starting to loosen up. For the delivery, a check on that go-ahead run at first. Dawson will stand in, but he might very well get four wide ones here to try and set up a double play ball that could get him out of here still tied. Here's the first pitch. Oh, and just a miserable effort there. It's 0-1. Your job right here on the mound, got to think strikeout number one, ground ball number two. You can't leave anything up that can easily be a sack line. Now a swing and a softly hit ground ball. Throw gets him, two down. Frankie Dawson will look for his third hit of the ball game now. Now a move over to first, just keeping him float. Now here's the first pitch. Oh, had him chopping at that one. It's nothing in one. Now he's probably lucky he didn't make contact on that one. Comes set. Now the pitch. Takes a pitch high and away for ball one. Comes set. Now the pitch. Now a swing and a fly ball. Vaccaro is over, and he puts it away in foul ground for the second out. And boys, probably a handful of deserving candidates for our top player of the game award, but what do you say we go ahead and give it to the man who shut the door out of the pen? Yeah, it's nice to have someone like this that you can call on to finish things. MLB The Show's coverage of minor league baseball is on the air as we continue our tour around the minor league. Coming up, we've got a good matchup in store between the Pensacola Blue Wahoos and the Birmingham Barons. And with first pitch just moments away, here's a look at today's starting lineup.
And then briefly, let's take a look at the two starting pitchers who get the assignment here. Frankie Dawson will stand in. A couple of hits in that ball game last night. Frankie Dawson. Now the first pitch. Swinging a ball hit on the ground. But a foul ball here, 0-1. He's ready now. The pitch off the plate. One ball, one strike. The 1-1. One, one. Keeping it down here as it's to 1-2. and two. And you figure to see that change up more and more as this day progresses. And the first time through the lineup, you want these guys to know that you've got this pitch in your arsenal. Sometimes pitchers want to hold on to pitches and not show everything right away. But here, you want these guys to be thinking. You know you've got that change up, so I'd better not sit on the fastball too often. Dawson will step in with a couple of guys in scoring position and a chance to pad this lead a bit early on. Here's the first offering. First pitch fastball off the plate there, and it's ball one. The next pitch. Swing and a ball hit hard on the ground towards second. Throw to first will get him easily, and the side is retired. So one run on two base hits, no errors, and two left. Three innings complete. The Barons are out in front here, one to nothing. Frankie Dawson will step in. He's lined out and grounded out in two trips. And now the second pitch of the inning is in the air to right. Miner is there, so two pitches and two outs thus far. Frankie Dawson will step in now with three home in the inning and another two men out there on base. This inning's really starting to unravel quickly from a defensive point of view. This is where you need a nice pop in a big way. And a ball popped foul to the right side out of play. Runners lead from first and third. Here's the pitch. Here's a late swing and a miss. Strike two. Very difficult to get on top of a pitch when it's coming in that high. Darn near impossible when it's coming at you in the high 90s. You just can't get... And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three, and that will retire the side. Will Ramey will be summoned from the bullpen now, so he'll take over to start inning number eight. Well, you always hope to get a good outing from your starting pitcher, but this man went above and beyond in this one. He's our top player. The stars of tomorrow get their shot in the limelight today as the show's coverage of the Southern League is on the air. And let's also get a brief look at our two starting pitchers as you see how they stack up right there. Frankie Dawson will stand in now. 0 for 4 in that day game yesterday. First offering on the way. And this is going to be a foul ball. Come set. Now the pitch. 
Pitch is way outside, and he can't even get a glove on it. And forget about the double play now as he'll move up to second here on the wild pitch. Here's the 1-1. Now he takes something off there as this is skied out to deep center field. Catch made out there in right center as the runner will tag from second. And he'll make it up to third safely here with one away. Dig in here. He flew out his first time around. Here's the first offering. Now a ball slapped hard the opposite way. Vaccaro has it, and I'd be surprised if they send the runner. But he'll wisely think better of it as he retreats to third, and that's an important first out. Frankie Dawson will take another shot here. He's flied out and lined out in two trips. Dawson. Now the first pitch. They'll try and entice him with a high fastball, but he wouldn't commit. It's ball one. And not only was that way high, but you've got to be careful not to airmail one over your catcher's head. And he just gets a piece there as this is chopped foul. Pause. Now the pitch. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Well, with every pitch it misses, he just keeps digging himself a deeper and deeper hole. Here's the two and one pitch. Oh, and this could be trouble now. It's three and one. Now the pressure will really start to mount out there. That strike zone's going to feel like it's the size of a soup can right now. Oh, definitely a fastball swing there, but a good time for the changeup. It's full three and two. Yeah, and I think if he lays off right there, that's going to be a run. You got to shrink your strike zone in that spot. Don't go after anything that's borderline. And this is fouled back and out of play. The next 3-2. And he gets a piece here as this ball is fouled away. The payoff pitch one more time. And look out as this bat shatters on impact. And that's going to land foul. Here's the three to pitch. And here's a ball hit in the air. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away. And that ends the inning. So one run here on three hits, two errors in the inning, and three men left stranded. Now back Frankie Dawson will try again. 0 for 3 thus far. Now here's the first pitch. And here's a ball hit in the air. And he will indeed make the play in foul territory to retire the side. So no runs on a hit here. No errors. One man left on. Well, you always hope to get a good outing from your starting pitcher, but this man went above and beyond in this one. He's our top player of the game. Yeah, he definitely turned in.
The show's coverage of minor league baseball is on the air as we continue our tour around the minor league. Ought to be a good one here between the Pensacola Blue Wahoos and the Birmingham Barons. And before we close in on first pitch, a look at the starting lineups here for the finale. And let's also get a brief look at our two starting pitchers as you see how they stack up right there. Frankie Dawson will dig in for the first time here, looking to change his fortunes a bit as he's seen that average dip these last four or so games. Now the first pitch. Fastball too high to start him out here, 1-0. Eric, you take a look at our visiting club as they take the field tonight here in the bottom of the first. They come in not exactly setting the world on fire as they've dropped five of their last eight ball games. Yeah, and the pitching really let them down last time. Too often their guys were falling behind and having to throw fastballs on 2-0 or 3-1. That'll catch up with you after a while. Here comes the 2-1. Swing and a ball lifted in the air toward the line and right. Miner is there and he'll make the catch to retire the side. And inning in the books tonight, still scoreless here on the show. Frankie Dawson makes his way to the plate to get us started here in the bottom of inning number three. Dawson. And they'll try and get him out in front to start the at-bat, but this misses off the plate away. It's ball one. And that's off his leg on the mound. And now, fortunately, they will get an out here. And time now to see quite where that got him. And it appeared from up here at least, and his actions on the field confirm it. It looked like it got him on his drive leg, which could be problematic, of course, for him. But from the way he's trying to walk it off, I think he's going to try to continue. Frankie Dawson will try it again. 0 for 2 with a fly out and a ground ball thus far.
First offering on the way. And he gets a piece here as this ball is fouled away. Pitch on the way. Grounded foul off to the right. We're in the fifth inning of a four to three ball game here. Now here it comes. In under the hands with a fastball, it's one and two. And now as a hitter, one and two, You've got to be thinking right center field. But take a little swing out and try to drive something the other way. And that's a fair ball as this one gets by him at third. Well, he'd had some high-stress innings here so far. It was looking like he turned a corner and was on his way to a much-needed one, two, three. But he's going to have to get in the stretch here after all. Andy Wilkins. We'll try again. Struck out swinging his last time through. Now here's the first pitch. And here's a ball hit in the air. Marquez is there, and the side is retired. So it's no runs on a hit, no errors, and a man left. We're through five here at the ballpark. Pensacolo's out in front here, four to three. Designated hitter, Frankie Dawson. Here's the first offering. Now here's the ball sent out to right center field, and that's going to get down for him, a base hit. Not too many balls hit solid tonight. Just their sixth hit of the game, so now they need to figure out some way to string a few of these together. Some action out in the bullpen. Couple of right-handers starting to loosen up. First pitch coming. Andy Wilkins. Stands in as he checks his swing here for strike one. E.K., the starter creeping up on 100 pitches now, but that number alone doesn't appear to be affecting him too much at all. Yeah, he still looks sharp. Still, with the way the teams handle pitchers nowadays, I don't think he'll wind up going much further. The 1-1. Swing and a line drive, but this will be foul. The one two. Now a swing and a ball popped high in the air over toward foul ground. But this will land untouched. A big pitch here, one and two. And he struck him out, his seventh of the ball game, and that ends the inning. Starting to run out of innings here as they are unable to cut into the deficit. Full of fine individual performances to choose from in this one, boys. But what do you say we go ahead and let this man take home the hardware? He's our top player of the game. Yeah, he was definitely a big part of this victory. You see there, four RBIs for him in the ball game. He came through when they needed him to, and he was instrumental in the win. So that just about does it for EK.